There are not nearly enough men here. Then it's fortunate the city guard doesn't take sentry assignment as seriously as you do. This bodes well. Huh. I'll be a first. This may not be such a terrible plan after all. And what exactly is that supposed to mean? Only that your last secret shortcut was nowhere near as secret as you claimed. Yeah, but that's half the fun of it. Life's too short for perfect plans. You want a plan that'll keep you on your toes, stop you growing old and complacent. Worked for you, has it? Clive, my boy. Even life's smallest challenges offer the opportunity to grow and to change. You must embrace these moments. Allow them to suffuse your heart with a deep sense of fulfillment. <sighs> Narrowly escaping death at the hands of an enemy is not my idea of fulfillment. Hmm. Something wrong? Not at all. Just wondering if the two of you had finished. Right. We make for the Mother Crystal's heart as planned. Destroy it and the whole thing should come tumbling down. And if the passage to the Inner Sanctum is guarded? Then we embrace the moment and use it to grow and change. Come on, this way. Try to stay out of sight. Obviously. Don't worry, the passage is empty. So shut your gob and keep your eyes open. They're not from the garrison. I swear this passage used to be the secret. Upon us. Of course it is. Perfect plans, Clyde. Perfect plans. Never stood a chance. You're welcome. The main tunnel. That would be my guess. There are sentries everywhere. And all good things must come to an end. We might have a bit more company from now on. Captain! Two arms! Man. Summon the cannoneer! At once! <laughs> <laughs> I was talking about earlier. What have we here? More insects come to be squashed. You will find my mortar and I only too happy to oblige. We were talking. 
Then let's shut him up. Why won't you die? Is he... Oh, bollocks. He's gonna catch it. Poor Patch. Save your pity. You'll get none in return. There's nothing left of him but hatred and rage. Let's end his torment. Still a man. A man who drowned in ether. It's no way for anyone to go. Come on. Guard duty's a death sentence in this place. Not that Sylvester cares. <laughs> the blessing, my friends. Who said being a dominant doesn't have its benefits? Sid, this is an ether flood. There shouldn't be one here, should there? The workers couldn't survive this. Well, it wasn't here last time, I can tell you that. Which means we need to be quick. The ether won't hurt us, but I'd rather not find out what it's done to everyone else. Doesn't look that far. Right. I used to be. I'll take that as a thank you. 
Look on the bright side, eh? At least you won't get lost. This won't be easy. I see they replaced that wooden door with something a little more sturdy. On the count of three. Three. What happened to two? Ask one. Once more. Aye, seeing as you're trying now. As if that was going to keep us out. The Mother Crystal's just up ahead. Is it? I can't see a thing. Well, unless someone's moved it.
There's no one about. I knew it would be big. But this... There. That's our way into the inner sanctum. You'd think they'd have patched that up by now. A sorry state the Empire's in. Wait. You don't mean... Aye. My little game of hide-and-seek with Bahama ended here. A tragic cost to this remarkable architecture. Don't blame me, he started it. But how did he make it out alive? I walked. You should try it. Gate be here in the mines. There are two places connected somehow. When I was in the Imperial Army, soldiers assigned to the Glass Gate would tell stories about something they called the Guardian. Can't say I saw anything like that when I was last here. Then again, I can't say I made it this far. Let's just be careful then. Where did that come from? If I had to guess... Poor beast. Another victim of the Flood. Fight he wants. Ready, Clive? Always. Yeah! <laughs> 
off to now. Clive, look out!
be all right. Fine. The inner sanctum lies just beyond. Chances are the palace guard knows we're here. We should move. Not that any sane commander would send his men into a place awash with this much ether. Clive. If this all works, and the blessing fades, things are likely to get worse for our kind before they get better. Being the last to wield ether will make our talents that much more sought after, by which I mean hunted. I just hope, in the end, they'll see that we didn't have any other choice, that it was the only way to get us to a better place. And here I was, thinking I was the uncertain one. Luckily, two out of three of us have faith in you. Then it all starts here. Time to earn that menacing title. Sid the Vicious, was it? Second thoughts? Not me. We're with you to the end, Sid. Then what are we waiting for? Beautiful. The heart of Sambrek. Well, that didn't work. I think we're going to need a bigger sword. Mine's bigger. Thank you, Clive, but I meant that figuratively. The core's clearly made of sterner stuff. Taja's going to have a fix when she hears about this. Stand back. It's about to get cramped in here. Freeze. 
I need a freight. Come to me. I can't do this without you. Not again. Where are you? Hold on. I've been here before. Yes.
isn't yours. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
Dieu. Enjoy your nap. You're wounded. This? It's only a scratch. All right, the hole. We'll... we'll find you a healer. Here. No, you won't. I know who you are, and if you think, I'm gonna let you have him. Think again. Try not to talk. <sighs> Clive. For so long, I thought I had all the answers. But then I met you. And I learned it wasn't a good death we should be fighting for, but a better life. It's all very well, a man. Reclaiming his fate. But if he can't choose how he meets it, what's the point? So, I made a choice. Blessing is a prison, Clive. And if it's an outlaw the world needs to help it break free. Stop. Please. I can think of none better than you. <laughs> Ashen grip, 
Let ember glow to kindle flames anew. Sorry, Clive. Had I arrived but a moment sooner. Do you remember me, boy? I saw you protect them. That was very brave. I know you're there, Ultima. You have learned our name. What else have you learned, Phoenix? My travels have revealed much about you and your ambitions. I know that it was you who tore me from my brother. And I know that it is his power that you seek. But know this, if you want him, you'll have to go through me. Very well. Breath of mine ancestors, fill these lungs that I may dispel the songs of suffering. A disturbance. This is getting us nowhere. We agree. No more games, Phoenix. We are come to claim our vessel. And I said no. These flames are nothing. You will know what it is to burn. Yours is a fleeting form. I'm not fool enough to think I can harm you. But, to protect my brother, I don't have to. These are not flames of destruction. Have you forgotten already who I am?
must be here. Must fail Lord Kupka again! Find shit! Are all fucking dead! Sid, help us! Where is he? Ah, you'll do! Ah. Bastard! Gab! We've got to go! I'm not without this! Sid is not among the dead. Shall I send a Stolas? That won't be necessary.